Good morning everyone. Let's jump into it. I feel like I don't have a minute to spare today. I'm super busy, but I still wanted to practice my chess. And that means doing a video. I actually find recording the video very, very useful. What it does is it forces me to think more because I don't want to look like a complete fool on YouTube, believe it or not. Even though you might not always be able to tell that. So it makes me think more. It does make me slow down a little bit. And also, the review helps me a lot. The review process. So, I don't know. I think it's actually kind of cool. It's, it's kind of nice. Oh... Uh oh. Uh oh. I've messed up, haven't I? Oh well. Oh, he's doing that. Okay. Well, that's odd. I'm going to trade queens then. And I win a pawn. Okay, interesting. Let's get this guy out. Hmm, I will win another pawn. Because the king used to be guarding that, as you know. Um, let's see, where should I go here? Let's go like... I don't think there's much point blocking because, uh, well, am I going to castle here? Um, oh boy, let me think for a second, guys. Should I just move my king or should I block? I am going to block here. Now, if I attack the rook, he's just going to move it here. But if I can get my bishop there first, if I can get a bishop here, then his rook is trapped. Does that make sense? Yes, it does make sense. So. Let us, oh, hold on, yeah, we're going to go up like that, start pushing these pawns, guys. Okay, this is a this is a dangerous game that we're playing here. So here's what I'm thinking. Push this pawn. He's gonna take. I'm gonna put my bishop here. And then if he's greedy and he takes this pawn, then I bring my bishop here and I think his rook is trapped. Is it not? Mm, oh well, I think it's it's too late because now he's attacking my bishop, which is not cool. 
Not cool, man. Not cool. So let's bring it back to... Um, let's just come back to here. I don't know. Now he might continue going after me. He might jump his... Yeah, I kind of thought about that. And that's fine. I'm not... Oh, shoot. He's going after this pawn now. Well, I can protect that pawn. Okay. That's not the nicest position, I know. Let's kick this knight out. I think we should kick out this knight, guys. What do you think? Hold on. Where can he jump? He can't go here. He could go... Uh, he can't go here. He can't go here. He can't go here. So he has to go here or here. Um, I can also kick him out by putting my bishop here. Forking. He has to move, but then that comes with an attack. So never mind. Let's let's use a pawn. We're kicking that knight back, guys. And now I can do... Wait. Need to be careful. So I was thinking bishop to here, but what's the point, right? Now, I could go bishop to here, and if I take that knight, he doubles his pawns, which would be nice. But then he's going to get my pawn. So let's let's take care of this first. We're going to go here. Ooh. Okay. So I'm thinking if I go here. Wait. Boy, this guy's playing really well. I'm getting kind of crushed here, aren't I, guys? Not cool. Not cool. Oh, man. Why am I playing so badly? Um, yeah, why am I playing so badly, guys? I don't really know what to do except go after this rook, and then he's going to move it, and I'm going to trade the knight. So let's... I don't know. Let's do that, I guess. What do I know? Okay, yep, that was a huge blunder. <laughs> I'm done. <laughs> um, I got completely crushed there, guys. Like, completely crushed. I want to just check my blunders real quick. Wait a minute, I was winning? That's impossible. Huh. 
Huh? What? I don't understand. Do you guys see a blunder here? I don't understand. That's an unfortunate error? What? How so? Guys, I'm really confused. Real quick, do you guys see a blunder here? If so, leave a comment because I'm staring at it and I do not get it. I do not get it, guys. Um, what do I do here? Oh, do I just do I just take the knight? That's not really a blunder, is it? Uh, what? I have no idea. I just literally have no idea what's going on here. Okay. And now what? How am I winning? Get my night out. Okay, I I don't get it. I thought I was losing. Uh, leave a comment if you see. I even looking at this analysis, I don't get it. Let's actually do the show line thing. Maybe that's better. Take take. Unpin. Okay. Um. Yeah. I don't know. I don't. I guess I am up two pawns, which is good. But I don't know why that's plus five. Ooh, rough start, guys, but you know what? That's okay. We're going to recover. Oh, my. <laughs> Here we go. Let's do a new 30-minute game. Oh, I'm white again. Okay. Let's, let's do better. Let us do better. And I hope this guy takes a minute to think at some point because my coffee just finished, and I do need to go get it. So, London system opening as usual. Boy, I guess I should have thought about that. Well, you know, like I said, I don't have a lot of time today, so I need to play a bit faster than normal. And that's okay. This might not be a good day for chess. <laughs> but that means it's a good day for you, because you are going to find blunders that I overlook in my rush. Hmm, is this a good time to go get my coffee? Yeah, let me do it real quick. He's thinking. Oh darn. Hold on. Let me see. Um We're gonna do that guy. Alright, I'll be right back. As I suspected, that move has thrown off my opponent and he has to think about it. Good, he's he's playing very nicely. Nothing too complicated or confusing, which is cool. I like that. So I might put my queen out here to attack that weak pawn. Whoa. Okay. Maybe not. Let's just drop back. It's okay, guys. And if he pushes this forward, then I meet him with my pawn. I've, I've seen this stuff before. Oh. Well, that's interesting. Let's get our knight out here. Because we might have this trick soon. Queen to here. Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hold on a second, guys. If I put my bishop here attacking the rook, he's going to put 
his pawn forward. That's the most natural move. He's not going to block with his knight. Because then my bishop can just chill out here forever. Uh, so he's going to push his pawn forward. I go boop, give him a check with my queen. He cannot block it. So he has to move. Uh, where would he move to? You know what? Let's not do that. Let's bring our knight out. Uh, there's definitely some stuff going on here that we're going to be able to take advantage of, I think. Unless he pushes that pawn now. Hmm. Oh well. We're going to attack that weak pawn, I think. Does that make sense? Is that a terrible idea or a reasonable idea? Let's... Oh man, oh man, oh man. Um... Man. I feel like I should do something over here. Since he moved his G-pawn, this is... This is nice. This is a... Uh... How about if we push this pawn forward and attack? Uh, no, I don't want to do... Let's, um, let's offer to trade knights. Trade a knight, and I get my bishop in a nice little spot. Induce him to push this pawn forward. And then I'm going to come over here with a check, and we're just going to see what happens. Okay. Like so. Now I have to be very careful here. I don't want to mess up, but I think if I put my queen here, he absolutely has to move his king. Right? Is that is that crazy? I'm pretty sure that's right. And he cannot attack my queen in one move, so let's do that. He has to move his king. And then I think I'll just drop back my bishop because I don't really know what to do next. <laughs> I, I like the idea of making him move his king, but I don't really have a follow-up, I'll be honest. Okay, good. So now, ooh, now I put my queen here. Give him another check. And then what's he going to do, guys? Well, I don't know. I don't know what he's going to do. Let's give it a try. Am I blundering here? This seems very, very dangerous. Yeah, and I think I might have lost any kind of advantage I have. Oh, well. Uh, I don't know what to do. Do I trade queens or do I go for something else. I wish this pawn wasn't here or this pawn or you know or or something. I don't know what's going on here. Yeah, I think I've messed up, guys. I need to now trade queens. Otherwise, I lose a piece. Ah, oh, that's disappointing. Ooh, good move, good move. He got his piece out, didn't he? Oh well, I think I'm still doing okay, you know? This bishop is absolutely miserable. I don't know why he didn't recapture with the... Hmm. Okay, I need to be very careful here now. Let's... 
Um, should I take should I take that? I want to be able to get my bishop out. Yeah, let's let's take that. And I'm hoping he takes with this pawn. <laughs> but he probably won't. That's just wishful thinking, isn't it, guys? This bishop is almost trapped. I'm just realizing that. Um, I'm going to push this pawn forward next. Oh, darn, I shouldn't have... Wait, no, it's okay. Yeah, I did need to do that. I think we're doing okay this game. Okay. Um, yep, we're going to go after this bishop, guys. Go in here. And then I'm going to push here. We're just pushing forward. If he moves his bishop, then I'm going to go after his knight. Ooh. Okay. Fair enough. Oh man, that's really annoying. But I'm going to defend that. Okay, here's what I'm doing. I'm defending that, getting my bishop out of the way, and now I can launch this pawn forward to attack his bishop. And we're going to we're going to make some progress here. I think I'm going to uh, I don't know if I should castle or not, but I want to get that bishop out of here. So let's do it. We're going to do it. Um, yeah, okay. I understand, but I don't think that really does anything, does it? Should I attack the knight or the bishop? Let's attack. Ooh, he can jump here with check. All right, let's go here. We're going to castle, unpin, and then go after the knight. So if he jumps here, that's guarded by two pieces now, and he only has one defender for that square. And now I can take his knight, so he better be careful. He does have to move his knight. He's playing well, though. I mean, I'm kind of surprised that how how much I am on the back foot, as it were. Ah, now I can go after this bishop with this direction. Okay, let me be careful here. Um, he's gonna take, yeah, let's do this. I wanna, I wanna open this puppy up. He's going to take here. Or, sorry, take here. Most likely. I'm going to take back with an attack on his bishop. He's going to retreat to probably right here. Not all the way back to here. That would be my guess. Then I'm going to take this pawn. He's going to recapture. I'm going to take with my knight threatening this pawn, which forks. Forks everything. Um, okay, so he didn't even take my pawn. That's interesting, guys. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna... We're gonna take that and threaten his knight. I mean, I think he has to take now. <laughs> right? Am I crazy here?
where he's going to move his knight once again, and I'm going to take a pawn with check, which doesn't seem like there's any point to that. I don't know. Where can he even move his knight? Back to here, over to here, here. He could go to here, but it's nothing very threatening. I don't feel threatened, guys. Okay, and now I'm going to take and I'm obviously threatening that pawn with an with an amazing fork. So he has to defend with this bishop. Oh, I can give him a check. Hmm, interesting. Okay, let me think. What? Oh, I can't go that way. <laughs> oh, darn. That was a really good move, guys. I I legitimately missed that. Okay, I'm going to just drop back to here. I don't want to cover up my rook. That seems nuts. He's going to come out here with his bishop and attack my knight. Oh boy. I think I might have to, oh, maybe not. Okay. Um, I think I might want to trade off that bishop. Let's give him a check first. I don't think that hurts me. Gets my bishop out. Now my rooks are connected, which is which is good. Okay. Now then, um, I need to I need to keep an eye on things here. Um, if I if I hit that knight, oh, let's pin him. Let's pin this guy. Whoa, that loses a pawn, doesn't it? Oh, but that traps his bishop, doesn't it? If he does that, first of all, I'll win his knight. Okay, let's do this. We're going to pin and kind of see if he falls for this. If he takes that, I can trap his bishop by pushing this pawn. And I or I could just go after his knight. Hmm, which one should I do, guys? Knight is pinned. He's going to probably just move. That would be my guess. Oh, that was a mistake. Now he lost the knight. Yeah, this is something I've learned. When you have a piece that's pinned and you want to defend it, but there's a pawn attack, it doesn't work. You cannot defend a pinned piece in that manner because I just attack with a pawn and it doesn't matter that you've guarded it, right? It doesn't matter, guys. Ooh, this is a little scary. What's going on here? OK. 
Okay, I think I'm okay. I'm gonna just trade. Okay. Um, okay, let's take that. This knight is still guarded, so I'm I'm okay, guys. I'm doing okay. Um, yep, he's gonna check me. That's fine. Let us What can I do here? What's the smart thing? Um I'm just gonna move my king over this way. He can he can attack me with his oh, hold on. If I go here, he's gonna go here and I'm gonna take him. So yeah, I'm okay. There are no checks here. We're done with checks. I'm still guarding. Everything's guarded except this piece, which is, well, yeah, even that piece is guarded because my knight is no longer pinned. He might take this free pawn now. Yep, okay. And that's fine. That's fine. Um, let's see. I can take his free pawn. Right? Or I can attack his bishop. Or I can attack his bishop here and, and win a pawn on the next move. Um, I can give him a check. Does that do anything? If I give him a check, he can't go here, or here, or here, or here. That forces him, or here, that forces him to take that. Oh my gosh. If I go here, and then give him a check, is that checkmate, guys? Alright, we're gonna try this. We're gonna go here, threatening a discovered check. Right? And if he takes the pawn right now, then I win his bishop, because I have a discovered check by moving my bishop here, and I take. I think resignation is incoming, everyone. I think I've got him in a, in a trap. This is amazing. His only move is... No, even that doesn't help. If he attacks that bishop, I'm going to go boom, check, and I think it might be game over. Not sure. His only saving move is pawn to here. That's hard to see. This pawn to here, guarding, so I can't come in with my bishop. Let's see if he finds that. That's Since I know what I'm planning, that's what I would do. Hmm. Okay, he missed it. Oh, but he did it a better way. Oh, wow. Um, very interesting, guys. Very interesting. Let's see what happens now. If I do a check, he can take the pawn. Oh, man, that was good. Now, I could guard... I could guard that pawn with my bishop. I could take this free pawn. 
Uh, I don't know what to do, guys. I can go after his bishop. Let's go ahead and take this free pawn. I don't think that hurts anything, except that he could bring his rook down here and give me a check, because this square would not be guarded. I also want to uh, kind of think about offering a rook trade since I'm up material. If I put my rook here, is he forced to trade? Probably not forced, but he can't take that pawn. And if he takes the knight, I take and then I recapture. Let's give that a try. I want to trade rooks. Hopefully this isn't a huge blunder. But everything is guarded. So I don't think I'm blundering. And if I get his rook off of this file, that's going to be a win for me. Now he might just slide over here and attack my knight, have a doubled attack on my knight. Hmm. Oh, but if he slides over here to attack my knight, I can also give him a check. What would that do? Where could he go? Oh yeah, he would just go here. Then I give him a check, and this is unguard. Yeah, that doesn't work. Okay, he'll just take my piece. Maybe I should guard this piece next. If he doesn't take... If we don't trade rooks, maybe I should guard that pawn. Oh man, I don't know. I really don't know, guys. He's playing really well considering he's down a piece. Right? This was probably a mistake. Because now he's going to end up winning a pawn. Well, no, I'll win this pawn in the end too. Okay, I think that was probably a mistake. Was it? Um, if I take this free pawn, does that hurt me? Does it help me? Does it do anything? It does mean that he cannot kick out my bishop very easily. Um, um, um. Or I could come up here and it, yeah, let's do this first. We're going to take the free pawn. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I'm safe. My rook is guarded. So if he tries to give me a check, it's not going to work. I'm going to take him. He takes, I take. Now this bishop cannot be kicked out um, unless he takes a bunch of moves to get his rook in various places. I think I might give him a check next. With my knight. So knight to here, check. Where would he go? Not to here, because then I can jump here with check. 
Oh, wait, and it's guarded by the pawn. He might take this with his king. Which would let me line up another discovered check. Oh, boy. Yeah, I think my opponent's walking into a bunch of traps here. So yeah, I think my next move is knight to here, check. Unless he takes this pawn right now. Darn. Shall we force his rook away? If I put my bishop here, he has to move his rook. Uh, off of this file. Actually, let's pin this bishop now. Yeah, we're going to pin that guy because then I can jump in here with check and he can't take me. His king's going to have to move. Can't go there or there because of my bishop. If he goes there, I can take his bishop. So he's going to have to go here. King to here. Now imagine, my knight's here. His king is here. What can I do next? Hmm... I don't know, guys. I don't know. I might. Uh, th there might not be really anything here. I wonder if I should make his rook move first. He could give me a check right now. Oh, okay. That's actually pretty clever. I kind of want to give him a check now, just to see what happens. Let's see what he does now. Okay. Um, I'm a little worried about him coming in here. So maybe we should put a rook here so that he can't come down and give me a check with his rook. Or should we now, now we, I think we can almost force this trade. If I go here, hold on. If I go here with my rook and he takes, I take, and then he gets a pawn. I could also bring my king up. Does that seem crazy? I could force his rook to move and then he would probably come over here and give me a check. Unless I get on this diagonal first.
Okay, I'm gonna go here, because I don't want him to give me that check. Now what's he gonna do? He might bring his rook here. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Have I blundered, guys? No, okay, I think I have blundered, but he didn't see it. Because if he put his rook... Oh, no, I would just take it, duh. Never mind. So if I go here, where is he going to put his rook? Let's jump over here, because this pawn is guarded now. I need to bring my knight into the game and not have him be quite so passive. Now I could jump here with a check, but no, I want to I want to explore this. What if I What if I go here now, guys? What's going to happen? Let's try it. I I don't really know. Don't really know. What are we going to do about this rook situation, bud? I want to get the rooks off the board. <laughs> I don't know why. Maybe maybe I shouldn't. But it's that old principle. Since I'm up a piece, it's to my advantage to trade. Um That's an interesting move. So if I go here, he's going to go back up here and win my rook. So how about if I go here? Or I could have gone here. Maybe that would have been better. I don't know. All right, man, what's your next move? Got to do something about these rooks. Hmm, interesting. Okay, well, I'm going to take this. Now I can save this pawn. Let's put him up 
here. You cannot win that pawn anymore, guys. I think my king is, like, really safe over here. He can put his rook here, but what does that do, you know? He can't come all the way to here, that's for sure. And now I control this square, this square, and this square with my bishops and my rook. Things are looking up. That's what I would say. I feel like just marching those pawns forward. But what should I do with this guy? Should I put him here? Yeah, let's just block this off. I don't totally know what to do, but that feels like a good move. My king is on a dark square, and he doesn't have a dark square bishop. So that seems good. Now... We need to activate our pieces here. I'm going to put my rook here, I think. Oh man, I do have a back rank vulnerability, guys. I think I'm going to put my bishop here and then slide in and, and threaten the rook trade. Mm, no, never mind. We just have to be careful. Okay, very interesting. Now I can give him a check. But is that going to do anything? He's just going to come in here. I don't know. Let's let's do the check just in case that amounts to something. Like if he goes back, then he's in big trouble. Cuz my rook will come in there. Let us attack the Bishop. Gotta move, Mr. Bishop. And if he guards it with his king, then I'm gonna force a trade. Oh, darn. What was that? I don't know, but let's go here. He's getting in position to attack this pawn, isn't he? Aha! We can force this now. Yep, we're forcing the trade, guys. You have to take it, bud. You have to take it, and you're losing one of your last attacking pieces. Now he cannot gang up on this pawn. Oh, he might have just really screwed up, because I can put my rook here. He, his bishop is pinned. If 
I put my bishop here, where's he going to go? I don't know. I'm just trading. Let's see. He... Whoa, what's going on here, guys? We got a check here. This pawn is pinned. I have a feeling I'm making a bunch of blunders though. I feel like he might have done something different with his king and really gotten me, you know? Okay, let's take that pawn, everything's guarded. I'm just gonna push these pawns, guys. I don't know, okay. It's a delaying move, but he cannot get by there yet. Yep. Um If I go here and he comes and gives me a check, I just go up one and he can't do anything right am i crazy here let's see what happens i i don't know what's going to happen guys i really don't okay i'm going to go up one and now what I don't see how he does anything, guys, with just a king and a rook. And I've got three pawns. I just have to not lose all my pawns. <laughs> and then I'll be fine. It's 
So here's my game plan. I'm going to put my bishop back here. Ooh. I think I'll just start... Yeah, I think I'm just going to push this pawn, guys. I'm not afraid. If he puts me in check, that's fine. I will just go here now. And then I'm going to go here. And I'm basically impossible to check. I mean, yeah, he can make like multiple moves to check me, but that's okay. I'll have time to start pushing pawns. Huh? I don't know what he's trying to do, guys. I really don't. Oh no! Oh my gosh, he actually beat me. <laughs> I have to say a comment to that. No, I'm sorry, bud. I'm not gonna play that. Uh, oh wait, 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 no, no, I, I wanted to um, look at the review. Let's, let's do the game review. I was winning until the very last... Wait, I was still winning? How does that work? Oh, whatever. I don't know. I lost my rook. I have to go here. And he takes. And then I'm just dead. I don't know how to win this. I mean, maybe I can, I don't know. Oh, that's depressing. I can't believe I lost that. Oh well, guys. Oh my gosh, I can't believe that happened. Um, but I'm gonna stop here. Like I said, I'm super busy today, so I don't have time to do a third game, even though I lost two in a row. I played terribly. Look at that, 70% for both of them. I think it's just because I'm thinking about other stuff. I'm, I'm too busy today. Anyway, hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you played better than I did. I hope you found my blunders. Um, hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you next time. Bye.